This is my intro, this is my intro, this is my intro to my video. Hi everybody, so today I'm gonna do a haul video um, from all of the stuff that I got from Harry Potter World. And I got a few things from Universal, so I'll show those too. I didn't realize how much I bought until I got it all around me. So I bought a lot of stuff. I hope you enjoy. So the first thing is behind me. I got this new um, Hogwarts throw blanket. Which, mm, I love blankets. They're great. And next we're going to start with all the candy I bought. So, point to the stuff. So, you got the Butterbeer first. This is the collective mug. And then I had a Butterbeer from this, which this is cheaper than the collective mug. Then, this is just basically a bottle of water, but it's called Gilly Water. And I mixed it. Cause they can mix with different like elixirs and stuff. So I mix the gilly water with the drought of peace. And it was kind of like blue raspberry flavored and it was really good actually. But the bottle is cool. Um, I got the pumpkin juice because it looks cool. But I tried it and I did not like pumpkin juice. It did not taste good at all. Ugh. Then we have some fizzing with beef. It, let's see. Chocolate fizzy fruits is what it says. So that sounds yummy. It kind of looks like a cool package and everything. Then I got love potion from Weasley's Wizard Wheezes. Apparently this is a candy. So, and it was a cool, cool, cool bottle. Liquid sweet. So I figured I'd go ahead and get it. Then of course I got Birdie Bot's Every Flavor Beans. Which I haven't gotten into them yet. Because I just got home like a bit early this morning. Then I got some Exploding bonbons. So the orange and pineapple flavored bonbon. That sounded yummy. Then two splintering strong mints, which are actually really good. And you only need one of them because they're really strong. Um, then I got some pepper imps. I sort of like peppermint kind of things and cinnamon flavored things, but the candy and the bottle, I just wanted the bottle, so I got the candy as well. Then I got a Honey Dukes jar that has the Sherbert Lemons, which apparently are Dumbledore's favorite sweets, so obviously I had to get it. Um, then I got, I'm pretty sure this is like a jawbreaker thing. But it's an eyeball. So you can eat an eyeball. <laughs> and then I got, obviously, I got chocolate frog. Two of them are mine. And one of them's for a friend. Cause I just had to get her a chocolate frog. And I already opened one of them. So, here. So the box is really cool. It's in a plastic wrap. And then you open it up, and I've already kind of taken a bite out of it. It's really good chocolate. It's like a huge frog. And the card I got, and this one, is Helga Hufflepuff. And you see, when you turn it, she moves. And it has a description on the back of it. If you want a freeze frame, you can read it yourself. So that's the one I got in this one. 
I really hope that in one of the three ones I bought, it's got Ravenclaw because I am a huge Ravenclaw. <laughs> all right, that's all the sweets I got. And now moving on to some of the toys and stuff I got. So this one's for a friend, um, Professor Umbridge. <laughs> Me and her call her the big pink ball of suck. And I thought she would enjoy this, so I bought it for her and got it in we Weasley's Wizard Weezes. And then I got a golden snitch. Cause I just had to get a golden snitch. Um, I didn't get the one that, you can get one that you hook up to the ceiling and it flies around. That was more expensive. This one, it just stands on that and it flaps its wings. So that's kind of cool. I got a few buttons. The packaging got messed up in the rain. But I got some buttons. Say Weasley's Wizard Weezes on them. I got a decoy detonator. Which I haven't figured out how to turn it on. Because <laughs> there's not a whole lot of instructions on it. So if you want to comment down below and tell me how it works. That would be great. Because I got it out to try to use it. And I couldn't figure it out. <laughs> and I got a extendable ear. Because this was the coolest thing. I guess you can hook it up to here and like, I don't know how long it goes out to. 12 feet. Extends 12 feet. So you put it, that piece right here in your ear and then I guess you extend it out up to 12 feet. And you can listen so that's kind of cool it kind of explains it on the back of it okay the next thing I have is the time turner and I just had to get a necklace because Hermione had a necklace so I had to get a necklace for him and it comes with this nice box and you can pull it out and the cool thing is it you can twist it either way and the sand moves if you turn it. Which is kind of cool. So that's one of the things I got. And I got the Triwizard Tournament Cup that acted as a transporter thing to the graveyard where Voldemort comes back. But it's cool and apparently it comes apart and one part you can put in the dishwasher and one part you can put in the uh, hand wash it. I'm guessing this is the hand wash part. And um, it lights up, which is kind of cool. And you can put some drink in it. So you can drink from it too. So that's kind of cool too. So that's that. As we move along, I've got some clothes over here. I got the sweaters, Ravenclaw obviously. I got a pullover and a button up. And then I got the robe, which is nice. I got some shorts that have uh, Ravenclaw on the back of it and have 07. I got the socks and the tie and I figured out how to tie <laughs> the tie. <laughs> um, I got the headband and little hat and I got some gloves to go with it. I still have to buy like a white shirt and a black skirt but I figured I'd buy those cheap. Um, so that's kind of like with the uniform. Then I got this Ravenclaw shirt which I thought was cool. 
And I have these in all the houses. Um, then this is for my best friend who the other two things are going to. But she's having a baby. And seeing as I'm a Ravenclaw, she's the Slytherin. One of her friends is a Gryffindor. She wanted me to be a girl, a Hufflepuff onesie. So I thought this was really cute. <laughs> so I got this for her. Um, I got a jacket that has the huge Ravenclaw thing. And a Ravenclaw on the side of it, written. Um, and I also got a shirt, which I'm wearing, and it says, I'm solemnly swear that I'm up to no good. And in the sunshine, where is it? They have these little paw print or footprints that show up when in the sunshine, which is kind of cool if I said so myself. Okay, so I also got a I don't know what you call them but I need something to hold my ticket and my express pass and my um, room key so I got this and it's a Ravenclaw obviously and I got a Ravenclaw pin a head girl pin because I obviously would be a head girl because <laughs> the smart kid in high school. A prefect one and a Hogwarts Rails Ways pin. And it's got the Hogwarts crest on it. And then I got this one because it was my birthday on the 14th when I was there and everybody said happy birthday. I believe they were going to give me something in Weezy's Wizard Weezes, but um they didn't have it so next thing I have is I got now cuz I got the Harry Potter package and they don't carry the um, box with the owl in it anymore to be like owl post so I got me an owl and the creepy thing is is its head moves all around so that's a little creepy but um, no. Moving on, I got some other pins. I got a chocolate frog pin, and the little frog inside smells like chocolate, which is really cool. Um, I got a sorting hat pin, and it turns, and obviously it would land right here <laughs> for me. It's got all the houses, Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Slytherin and Ravenclaw on it and the cool sword and hat. Um, I got a Deathly Hallows pin. I'm also getting in the mail a bracelet I got from some website and it's got Deathly Hallows on it too. So that's cool. And I got a Ron pin because I love Ron. I know that's stupid but he's cool. And Rupert Grint is bad himself. <laughs> Um, and the next thing, um, instead of the box, I got to go to shutter buttons, um, and it takes moving pictures, which if I can get them loaded, I'll put like a small video for it of some of them. And it, all of the stuff has the Wizarding World of Harry Potter on it. So that's kind of cool. Moving on to some other things. I got the Quibbler, and I guess you can punch these out, but I kind of want to leave it, not open it. Pandemonia at the Ministry. Wax Burts. It's kind of cool, actually. I wish it was like the whole Quibbler but it's just the front and back of it, but whatever. Um, I also got um, Marauder's Map. 
So it's one of the ones that fold out like all the way. And it has other things to fold out. And it folds out ew, the other way. And somehow it got a little wet. I don't know how that happened. But that's interesting. Um, I got a ticket, the Hogwarts to London, and on the other side it's London to Hogwarts. Um, and it has platform nine and three quarters on it. Ooh. I got a nice little journal. It's got the Ravenclaw symbol on it. Um, and it's got parchment paper on the inside. So I got the quill with the sharp edge point on it. And I got the ink bottle. I got blue ink. Blue's my favorite color. Um, I got the stamp to put on letters. It's a Hogwarts wax and seal kit. And it looks like that after you're done. Got several postcards to give to a few people. Um, Harry Potter one. And now over Hogwarts. Hogwarts itself. And a little bit of Hogsmeade. The dragon. On top of Gringotts. And Hogsmeade. And on the back of them, I got Hogsmeade stamps on all of them. So that's kind of cool. And then the last things I got from Harry Potter World are my wands. The bags that they came in, um, they have all our on them, but they kind of got messed up in the rain and traveling. They kind of don't work very much anymore. But I got two wands. And these are the boxes that comes in. This is the um, character wand. And it's not interactive. And this is a Rowan wand that it went for my character. And this one was interactive. So you can go to, um, and it comes with this map. And you can go over Diagon Alley or Hogsmeade and you can do like spells and different things at them and they make things happen. Some of them have like signs in the window where you can't do the spell, which sucks, but whatever. So the one in this box is, this is a rolling wand. It's got a skull on the end of it. Kind of look cool. And then the interactive part is this little ball and it goes to like a camera and you point to it and you do the spell we got him Liviosa and you let the feather go up and then this wand if I can get it out oh I did it is Ron's wand because if you haven't caught it on I love Ron so this is his round I'm not sure if this is his second wand or his first but it's kind of cool. And I like it. So that's everything I got from Harry Potter World. Um, then I have like a few things I just got from Universal. Like this thing to protect from the rain. Because every day I was there, it rained in the afternoon. So yeah um this is my room key it's got my name on it i stayed at portofino bay oh this is the last thing uh they give you this sticker and you scan it if you want to print a picture that you got from one of the rides um i got a fan with this water in here, but I had to empty it because I was flying. And um, 
the fan turns on from this button, the batteries were right, and the fan goes, and then you squeeze this, and it sprays you to keep you cool because it was so hot outside. Um, if you buy this drink, you can go to the Coca Cola freestyle places and get free drinks the whole time. So that was cool. I had to get a, in the airport, I had to get this, a magnet for Florida. So I was there. And the last thing I bought. was this bubble gum um, shrimp company cup. I got a drink and they let me bring home a fresh clean cup and it's really cool because I always wanted to eat at bubble gum and they have really cool things which you might see um, in the video I'm gonna put up so I hope you liked my video of my haul of all the lovely stuff I bought. Um, I hope y'all have an amazing day and keep watching. Bye! Thanks for watching my video today. If I could tell you one thing to go out and do is do one thing that may be on your bucket list or you haven't done yet that you want to do, just go out and do it and enjoy yourself. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe to my channel.